Russia launches a new air attack on Ukraine as fighting in the east intensifies, and Vladimir Putin makes a bizarre new claim. Greg Palcott has more from London. Russia launched a new air assault on Ukraine Tuesday, the fifth attack since the start of the month. Ukrainian air defense is shooting down 23 of 25 missiles, a sign Ukraine's missile defense systems are becoming more effective. Meanwhile, in the east, heavy fighting reported for a second straight day in the city of Bakhmut, with the head of the Russian Wagner mercenary group now claiming the Ukrainians have the upper hand because the Russian army is deserting. Today, one of the units of the Ministry of Defense fled from one of our flanks, leaving positions everyone abandoned the front line. This all comes as Moscow celebrates its Victory Day holiday with an annual military show. This year's event was scaled back significantly. There was no flyover and a noticeable shortage of tanks and armor. Still, that didn't stop Vladimir Putin from making some bizarre claims about the war, including that Russia's enemies are, quote, collecting Nazis from around the world to fight. A real war has been unleashed against our motherland, but we have rebuffed international terrorism and we will ensure our security. And more bad news for Moscow. The U.S. unveiling a new military aid package on Tuesday worth some $1.2 billion, including more guns and ammo and the Hawk air defense system. We will continue to support the people of Ukraine as they defend their independence and their democracy. Also Tuesday, Ukrainian officials said that Russian authorities are preparing to pull out of Europe's biggest nuclear plant, ahead of a counteroffensive expected in the coming days. In London, Greg Palcott, Fox News.